Who's a good boy? Here, you want some? Who's a good boy? <laughs> Yeah. All right, so let's start right off here. We're going to start off with Treehouse. This is out of Boston. I um, like that can. Yeah, everything by them is good. Everything by them is good, except the fact that they don't distribute their beers. You have to actually go to their very, very few sites. This is our third IPA by them. This yep. is called Bright. Uh, I've, I've seen on there that they do make stouts. I, don't, I, don't, I would love I don't a stout of theirs. That. They do, they do. I'll believe it when I see it. it. It's got a nice pour. I'll give it that. And we've actually liked their stuff in the past. Yeah, yeah. I just have to get friends up in Boston to, to send it to me or, this is, or um, Providence or whatever. 7.8%. This is supposed Woo! to look, I mean, grapefruit, clementine, papaya. This sounds, is, sounds good to me. Ooh, this smells like a traditional IPA. Does it? This smells like what I what I think of as an IPA. Right, that reaction there. has me nervous. Yeah, now. it's. I think this is going to be pretty hoppy. This is a double IPA. We'll see what it's like. Says, I was going to say skunky, but I think it's more like the papaya and stuff like that. But uh, you like papaya? It's all right. All right. Ready? Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Come on. It's tropical. It is a very tropical. You know, it smells a lot hoppier than it actually is. Yeah, I'm not getting that lingering hoppiness it says, or anything. It says a, a gentle bitterness, yeah. and that's about right. Yeah. It's, it really is. It's got, yeah. it's got a... Um, I don't normally think of clementines as being a tropical fruit, no. but your papayas, your mangoes, your things like that, yeah, absolutely. But this is... I'm surprised. Yeah, the nose makes me a little bit hesitant yeah but it's it, but the, the nose, taste is the it's, nose doesn't really give way to what you think is going to be a nice or a piney mm -hmm. uh, ipa this is really it, it has a good gentle citrusness to it yeah. i keep going in for that nose and i'm gonna tell you i i mean it it smelled kind of skunky up a good to head. me at first and yeah. i'm not i get zero skunkiness no I mean, it's, it's, it's not it's it, this is this is you can tell this is really high quality they do things well yeah they really do and that might be why they don't distribute because they do things in smaller batches I so that the, the, uh, the quality control can be where it needs to be i am getting the papaya i i'm getting that that we'll phoned up in, yeah a little bit yeah you can get a good one there i am getting the papaya i'm not a huge papaya person it's tropical right. fruits but i'm getting it there no it's a grapefruit yep i love grapefruit getting it i'm getting it are you getting any clementine yeah a little bit of that citrus. Yeah. yeah. I hate it when you're drunk. It's smooth. It's got a nice it hazy, smooth. you know, a nice hazy appearance here. Yeah. Foamed up a decent little it's, head. It's not a hazy. No. It's not hazy. It, yeah. but, but I mean, it is. You know what I mean? It's not a hazy IPA. Yeah, yeah. It's not a New England IPA. This is a double, isn't it? It is. This is a double. Ah, uh, you know, I'm not getting. I wouldn't say this grows. But it's got such a strong initial flavor, flavor profile, and holds it. It really, it, that initial flavor note really stays. There's not very much bitterness, not very much hoppiness, no. and that's very drinkable. It's it, it, very drinkable. It's not an overpowering initial taste. Yeah, but it's consistently good. And I, I think that speaks to their quality control. I really, really do. It's how it and I'm not kissing up the treehouse just because they're from Boston. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's it's good. It, it is good. It really is good. It's good. That's uh, uh, This is what I say. Our, this is our third thing, third yeah. or fourth thing. Yeah. And if all you of, don't live in New England, them, you're, you're not going to find it. All of them have been good. Yeah. What are you going with? 4.0. 4.0? Yeah. Same. 4.0. Yeah. yeah. It's good stuff. It, it's really good. I like that a lot. We didn't even offer our friend here. Look at him. He's mad about it. All our subscriber. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Up next, we're going to Colorado. This is uh, Weldworks. Weldworks out of Greeley, yep. Colorado. This is their extra, extra juicy bits. India IPL, IPL, brewed and dro double dry hopped, 8.6%. It's a little bit higher than the treehouse. Mm-hmm. Never had anything about Weld Works. No. Hey, let me, hold on. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. All right. If he mentions orange juice, 
bite him. <laughs> good boy. Who's a good boy? Special guest appearance. Uh, <laughs> okay. That's hazy. It's pretty hazy. It's got a... Uh, I it's, think it's dialed like, in, I will tell you that. That's Not just because it says it on the can. You're exactly right. It, it's a little bit... It has a little bit richer color than the bright. Yeah. Look at that right there. You know what that reminds me of? What does that remind you of? That reminds me of the uh, Purdue train. The Purdue Express. So, yeah. mm. Anyhow. I've been derailed here lately. Anyway. Right, this is all out of Colorado. I don't know if Lauren Bubert or Bobert or whatever... You think she'd um, like it? Oh, I don't know. I don't know if this is her. I'm, you know, whatever. She's not. My, I'm not her constituent. So no, I'm not her. Let's I'm, stop right there. Oh, anyway. Yeah. Anyway, this this doesn't have quite the strong a nose as the treehouse. Not quite as strong. Maybe it's a, a different nose. It is different. Maybe a little sweeter. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Cheers, my friend. Cheers. Completely ridiculous. That's more like a hazy IPA. Yeah, I'm, I'm not getting, again, I go into it thinking it's a double IPA. I'm yeah. gonna get this hoppiness and I'm gonna hate it. It's very reminiscent of it is, the New England's that we've had. Yes, it is, it is very juicy. I'm Captain very Obvious. Very juicy, I, I, I won't use, I will don't, not use the do comparison. Do not go there. I don't want to get bit by a hellhound over there. <laughs> uh, Good boy. But it, very, it is a strong citrus, strong citrus quality to it. It's quite good. It really is. It really is quite good. I wasn't. Ex There's I was sweetness. honestly not expecting to like either of these. Yeah. And, I, and so far, I am. It's not. It doesn't have. I actually got more of a hoppy finish on this one than I am getting on this one. I totally agree. There. There's definitely a hoppy finish. It's not overpowering. It's not off-putting. There's. I mean, no hoppy finish to that, which is really surprising. I, I'm blown away. This I has really um, Citra Mosaic and El Dorada, El Dorada hops. I need to educate myself yeah, more on I'm, the different hops. We're not. We, we do like Citra, yeah, because we've uh, yeah, had that in yeah. several. So yeah. we've had uh, El Dorado in a couple of them too. Have we? Yeah, we have. All right. Anyhow, is it growing in the glass? I would say no. I would agree. But they both hit you with what they have. With what they it, and they maintain. I'm still, even as I make my way through this, and, and I think that it would it would be this way through the whole can. Yeah. I'm really, it is a really strong flavor profile, and it just it maintains. It doesn't fade. It doesn't yeah. wither, which is yeah. good. That's, that's, and, and when you say strong, I don't mean like I at least I don't take it as overpowering. No, no, no. no. It's, it's, but it's just, it's, it's flavorful. Yes. It's, yes. It's it's really good. This is really good. I was expecting with the extra, extra juicy bits, I was expecting pieces of fruit to fall out. A little pieces bit of pulp. Of, I, was, I was looking for some pulp to come out, but it didn't. I was and concerned. That's okay. And that's okay. I know your wife, when we've gone out, ha has liked some stuff that looks like a slushy. Yeah, to me. that's kind of what I was concerned And that's kind of what I was concerned yeah. with, that consistency. But, I mean, that's... That's good stuff. It is. I'm going to go with a four. I'm going to agree. Four. Two. I just, we I have can't. two, a four, two fours. I'm blown away. This, you know... We, we've learned so much about ourselves over the past, over this, most of this year doing this with these IPAs. We never would have done this until we started doing this. 30-some years of my life, I've said, I hate IPAs. I'm not going to drink an and here IPA. We, and here we are. And, I mean, there have been a few that we didn't care yeah, for. Yeah, there's some that are out there. The vast majority, we're like, oh, that's actually pretty good. Not necessarily a four, yeah, but... pretty good. These are pretty good, too, really good, Yeah, I would say. Good stuff here. Yep. My my uh, older son lives out in Colorado Springs. I'll have to Google Maps and see how far Greeley is. But I would definitely go to that Weldworks. It's good stuff right there. That was actually pretty good. Yeah. And anytime I'm in Boston, we will see the Red Sox. Two cool cans. Yeah. Uh, two cool cans there, too. Um, good stuff. We won again today. <laughs> we always Even won. our viewer won. I hate Woo! you. And a puppy. Come here, puppy. I have no idea. It's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. All right. Bye, Hellhound. Oh, now he stands up. Now he stands up. Thanks for watching. See you. Bye.